I would like to start with an input. <laughs> Very important to my heart. See, the thing that actually happened was I was backstage and I see something that says, Oklahoma, legal here, 10 milligrams per piece. And I'm like, I'll take one piece. And then I'm putting three pieces in my mouth and chewing them. And halfway through eating, I'm like, oh yeah, one piece. Okay, I've had three though, but here we are. I can't even be shitty, because I'm like eight minutes before the show's actually supposed to start, and I'm like, if I walk on and just start playing the guitar, it'll work. And I was half right. And I was half right. But, <laughs> how's everyone doing? My name is Pepper Coyote. You are welcome to the After Dark Show. Thank you very much for being willing to show that you are at least 18 years old. If you're under 18 years old, fuck you. Don't be a bitch. Please. You're not supposed to be here under 18. So therefore, I've insulted no one. You cock. You 17-year-old penis. Right? Feels weird, doesn't it? 18-year-old penis. <laughs> As a 30-year-old, I'm like, are you under 27? <laughs> the older I get, I saw a meme that hurt me personally. It had a picture of everybody and like all the Rugrats parents. And it was some frame where like it was the four dads and they were all just in a pool and shirtless. And it's like, they used to look like grown-ups. Now they just look like your friends. Oh, I just saw that too. And I'm like, oh. I'm Chaz. <laughs> One person who knows. Oh Chucky's dad. <laughs> I just am the Chucky's dad. And that meme where you're like, oh, what friend do I know like a ginger with a weird mustache? <laughs> Shut up! I don't know anyone from France. Somebody once told me the world's gonna roll me. I am the sharpest tool in the shed. Has everyone been let in? Are we gonna leave the doors open? Because I won't say any curses for like six songs in, I promise. And if we leave the door open, maybe someone will go, Oh, what is this? Let me wander into this completely normal musical performance. And then, She was looking down with finger in for me, the shape of an L on her head. The years stop coming, they don't stop coming. Fair to like in the ground running. It doesn't make sense not to live for fun. When your brain gets smart and your head gets dumb. Well, there's so much to do, so much to see, so much wrong with taking the back streets. You never go if you don't go. You never shine if you don't glow. Hey, now. You're an all star, but you came hard and go. Hey, now. You're a rock star. Get the show on and get paid. Not all the bitters is gold. Only shooting stars break that mold. Somebody once asked. That's the third verse. They say it's a cool place. You know it gets colder, you bottle up now until you get older. The media made begs to differ, judging by the hole in the satellite picture. And the ice we skate is getting thin, yeah, the water's getting warm, so go on and swim. The world's on fire. Cause I never, ever get bored Hey, now You're an all-star, you 
Get to show on and get paid. Not all the debtors is gold. This quote is accurate to Shakespeare because I am old. <laughs> Somebody once asked, could I spare some change for gas? I need to get myself from this place, which may or may not be Oklahoma. I said that's a concept. I could use a little fuel myself, and we gotta all use a little change. And we start coming. You don't stop coming. Fair to move, and I hit the ground running. It didn't make sense not to live for fun. Chuckling fucks. I'm an all star. It's Kayvon. Go play now. Rock star, get the show on and get paid. Not all the glitters is gold. Only shooting stars break that mold. There it is. I brush against my freckles and I hate it so the night goes on and I heave a little sigh for you. It's fair that the love that I would share for you, but it dissolves like it was just a sugar cube. A little pain now sitting in my heart's head, sugar can I bet but it really doesn't hurt me now. Those silly horoscope signs, guess I can't trust them after all. before this show gets very interesting. Let's do something. Set 38 minute timer. I'm oh, sorry, what? Hey Pepper, turn around real quick. Turn around? Oh, what what the? Sh what happened? Oh, there's a very phallic object behind you. Fox and Mars 
This is one part after dark show, which it's definitely going to be the entire time. However, my main point isn't just for me to be like, I'm gonna drug up on stage, it's gonna be hilarious. It's not just that. We are also here for a reason beyond ourselves, which is charity, because we are furries. And that is kind of like what we do in our public events. So, up front, if you want to put your spare ones, fives, tens, twenties, or hundreds, hey, uh, in the guitar case, they will not go to me, they will go directly to the charity, meaning directly to pay the amount of money it takes to feed a uh, large wildlife, such as tigers, wolves, bears, oh my. Oh, I stopped. <laughs> How dare you just... How dare you tee me up for a joke that I'm not allowed to make? <laughs> so if you want to make a donation that is cash, just throw the cash in there. If you want to do one that is card, come to this corner of the room. Any non-cash source will make it happen. Believe me, the tigers, lions, bears, oh my, will definitely appreciate it, whether or not you ever meet them in person. PayPal is also a non-cash payment source we can accept. This song is called This song is called Star, which is about a furry book called Save the Day, in which there are like animal anthro animal characters who are also superheroes. And the main character is a coyote, and he is afraid to tell the rest of his superhero squad that the coyote is homosexual and you like to date other superpowered male animals. I know, everyone's like, it's gotta be something extreme. All right, so anyway. We're bang, I'm at it again on overhead trip. Maybe I come and at me, but they don't see my friends.
thank you very much. I can tell you're all very tired. It's, <laughs> it's eight something. Oh, it's not. It's nine eleven. <laughs> I'm not trying to make any jokes, but that is what time it currently is. Let's skip over that song. Hey, everybody, do you remember how earlier in your lives you stood in a line for registration? I sang this song at opening, actually, but I want to do it again. If you want me to hear these horn lines, buy the CD. On the road, gotta beat the track. There isn't much at 4 a.m. I can hardly move inside this car. In the back, gotta see the magic. Mesh eyes staring back towards home. 600 miles can't be that far. What is this our fifth car? Okay. 
Thank you, my friends. I'm gonna do. I have one. I have yet one more special guest who will be joining me on this set. I think I have two more songs before that happens. I want to do a cover song as long as that's okay with everybody. That's part of my after dark thing. Is I'm trying to add some covers. That'll be fun. <laughs> this is the newest cover I think I know. Not the most recent one I learned, but like the newest, like the song that's the newest that I know how to play. No, I don't like that. can keep it go pull up and cut right through it's someone I believe in you're eating me like a filament anytime you're in the room you burn me and I'm smoking I just want to be able to watch you dissolve slowly in the pool But I don't know nothing about love. So the song is 
like about a 5 out of 10 if no one does the love callback. And you both had two chances. I don't know if you should be given a third one. I mean, like, maybe we just need to go to a song where people give a shit about me. And maybe... <laughs> okay, so here's how the song works. I go, problem, I don't know. Well, maybe I'm in love. Love, they turn about it every time. Like, anytime you hear love, just go, love, love. Like, if you hear love, yell it back on the next beat. Because that was about four times kind of randomly through the song. So she said, what's the love? Hey, you're awake. Problem, maybe. What's the problem? I don't know. Well, oh, maybe I'm in love. Think about it every time I think about it. Can't stop thinking about it. How much longer will you take to cure this? Just to cure it, cause I can't ignore it if it's love. Makes me want to turn around and face it, but I don't know nothing about love. Oh, Sounding word <laughs> for friend. Okay, so uh, I, I I have a friend here, a comrade even possibly, Cassidy Sivit, who's been doing music like all over the dang place for what has existed of our very young return to conventions season. We wrote a thing together, and I want to do it together. Please welcome to the stage to do a new song with me, Cassidy Sivit. <laughs> They're grabbing the other microphone, which I swapped out because it was about to die. So now, now the real fun starts. <laughs> What's gonna happen? Will we get through the song with both mics? I'm actually guessing yes. It says full battery. Look at us. It says full battery. Look at how full the battery appears to your <laughs> special eyes. <laughs> and how empty it appears to mine. Come on now, this song is called Raise a Glass, and it is, it's, it's kind of pandemic focused. I say focused, but it's not a downer, it's nice. You'll see, see what you think of it. How do you, see how you feel about this. I 
Gotta get off of it and admit Before I say something I regret Who taught me frustrated My brain goes to hard places It's been hard, not gonna lie And it's okay to break down sometimes But I can feel inside I'm gonna make it out of the night One day we'll be together One day when the world is better Raise the glass to the time to live on Like the last year of the life was paused And talk till the sun comes up We got a weekend so I stopped For more than a year I felt alone Months go by never saw a soul My little company at last Join in and raise the glass Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, you know, I felt that too Sometimes thought we would get through As days became weeks My outlook turned bleak I spent a lot of time just crying Not living, just surviving It's tough, but I know tonight I'm gonna make it out alive One day we'll be together Someday when the world is better Raise a glass to the time that we lost Like the last year of life was paused And talk till the sun comes up We got a weekend so I stopped For more than a year I felt alone Months go by, never saw a soul I'm in good company at last So join in and raise a glass Raise a glass Suits, and then I'm going to do uh, a strange thing. And by it's not that strange, it's not nearly as bad as uh, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I've done things in other AV shows that are weirder, so this is actually relatively normal. I'm going to do what I call the uh, shirts off my back auction, which is different from a charity auction in that the and that the money it does. I know, so how is it different from a charity? Right? It's different from a charity auction that I keep all of the money. And it's the same as the charity auction in that I keep all... It's the same as the charity auction in that the money goes to charity. It does not go to me. So, hey, let's do this song, which is called... Um, it's called, Can I Get the Capo to Do the Only Job? <laughs> I don't pay you to be a, 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 a bee. I 
They need to be a bee shark. You bee shit. That's pretty okay. This is not from Hairspray. Shut up. Oh, 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 woke up today. This is not from Hairspray. Thank you, the four of you who laughed. I'm waking up. I woke up today. You see, do you see what was in the back of my mind? Nothing. Lawyers, lawyers, do not sue me, guy who also made pink flamingos. <laughs> I'm only kidding, that's too low. What's their actual name? I can't remember. Nobody knows who did hairspray and pink flamingo. Roger Waters! Thank you, I remembered. I'm waking up to a whole new shade of gray. I think Roger Waters would be fine with the furry music. He'd be like, this is too tame. I'm seeing things that might make some run away. Look at the ears and the eyes. But some might understate. I'm finding it hard not to overcompensate. I feel the jitters as I step into the pond space. Can't come. 
Yeah. Okay. Let me look at my bizarre auction. <laughs> okay. okay. All right. Let me. I have two things. One has sentimental value. One has perceived value. Is everybody excited? Okay, welcome to sentimental value. This is meant to be a kind of short mini charity auction, which gives you all an excuse to pay more money than logically makes sense to, in order to help a charity cause, which in this case is directly feeding Tigers, like, we need to buy a lot of food for various animals, and that is what this money will go directly to. As I am told, maybe it'll all go to me, but I can only hope. So this here, if you've ever, I know, if you've, if you've ever driven a motorcycle, or if you do, or anything that is metal, this is a bag that also has a bunch of, like, magnet flaps on it, so if you have a gas tank, it's going to go, like, whack, and it, like, magnets, then you can also strap it on with this and if not it's just like a, a pretty useful bag with like several with several pockets what is my what what is my timer what could i possibly set a timer for 9 38 what uh, wrestling pay-per-view is tomorrow aw hey buddy hey there we are. It's gonna be great. CM Punk's doing a match. Anyway, uh, <laughs> it was like, oh my god, I'm very <laughs> Who? So there's several cool bags in this, and it's like a thick, pretty. It has, this is the water cover that you could put over it. So, uh, fuck all of the things I just said. Who would like to spend an amount of money greater than six dollars for a charity right now? Let us start the bidding at one dollar. Here are some rules as I go. If you say anything fewer than a $1 increment, I'm going to ignore you. It's not funny. We've all been to charity things. And 67 cents. And 68. You want to strangle 67 people if you do that shit to me. Never do that. It's not funny, actually. But thank you for coming to your first auction and thinking it's a great idea. What I'm saying is, don't waste our time. Give us some money. It's not for me. It's not about the bag. It's about the charity, meaning lions who are going to put possibly this bag into. What? Let's start the bidding at one dollar! Raise your hand if you have a dollar! Excellent! Who's got one dollar? Who wants to go to five dollars? Ten! Ten! Great! If you yell a number, that is a great way to make me your, fa make your favorite person yourself. Yell a large number. What was that large number? Fifteen! Who's got twenty? 20 over there, who wants to jump to 50? Because that would be exciting. $50? $20 going once. $20 going right. twice. Thank you, $30. Again, who wants to go to 50? 42, okay, that's 420 cents, therefore I'm allowed to take that bid. Excuse me, who said 50? $50, everyone go, yeah! We get one more who at 100. $50 going once. Going twice. Who wants to jump to 100 and make me jizz? <laughs> None of you? How cruel and unfortunate. Okay, who wants to go over 50 though? 50. We only have two of these. There's two options total happening. If you're like, let's make a fun thing happen. Now may be the time. $50 going twice. Last chance! Okay. I'll take a 53. I mean, if you really want to leave it at 53, it is more than a dollar, so I mean, fuck me, right? <laughs> 53 dollars! Who wants to take me to an even number? 53 going twice. Heads. I need to stop belittling all of you. Why am I doing this? Why am I like, I hate all of you. 
say a larger number. 100 is where I get actually excited. Hell yes, thank you very much for making this at least three digits and therefore not embarrassing. $300 going once, <laughs> twice! Three, it's only 100, I'm sorry. I, I didn't want to. I, I got a little excited there. It's only 100. I would do that to you. $100 once, twice. Anybody? $100 sold. Thank you very much. So here's why this has sentimental value. Yes, absolutely. So, um, if you see me tomorrow at the thing, I would love to write my name all over that, or even after today's show. I just can't do it right now. I have to I'd love to sign the things. Jade is the direct name of one of the tigers who you will be directly helping. And one of the names of one of the wolves you will be directly helping is Zina, right? Yeah. I heard you talking yesterday how there's various like, like, like wolf dog, wolf blah, blah, blah. Zena, full blown wolf, and is apparently this biggest sweetheart you ever met. Yeah. Right? You're like, I understand wolves now. Yeah. Like, wolves are great. <laughs> I'm over here as a coyote, like, well, one of us can stand humans building a mall, <laughs> and one of us can't. <laughs> All the wolves, oh, shut up, shut up, man. So anyway, <laughs> the reason I have sentimental value to me is that was, I'm not, okay, this wasn't a re-gift, but it was, though, because my boyfriend, more years, gave that to me when I still was at the tail end of my motorcycle career, and then I kind of lucked into, like, I'm broke, need to sell a vehicle, and someone's like, I'll give you a thousand for the thing. They got it. We had to get a battery in it that worked. We're bungee cording a weird battery into the bike, going off. The next day, they get very lightly bumped by a car. $2,000 insurance claim. We all benefit in the end through this motorcycle transaction, but I no longer own a motorcycle. What I'm saying is, don't commit insurance fraud, but if you very coincidentally get in a very minor accident that you can get two grand out of, do it! Just do it! Who cares? State Farm's got the money. <laughs> Last weird auction. This is a double shirt thing. Both of these are sized men's large because they used to go on me. One is special because it has an album cover on it. This shirt no longer exists because I hate shirts because I hate bringing multiple sizes of things to things. I'm very lazy. This is a shirt that is about my album, Ma. And if you wanted one, this is, it doesn't exist anywhere else. This one has been worn by me about 70 times. So, hey, is that a positive or a negative to you? I don't know. Here it is. Uh, this shirt is uh, from Threadless. <laughs> Do you get it? Who yell, yell it? What's the pun? EV for Vendetta. Get it? Thank you all. So that can also be yours. As far as <laughs> it's like, now I'm angry. <laughs> we have EV for Vendetta, and we have uh, me. This is uh, Ma, an album cover. Uh, I would love to, 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 to make some charity money off of things that I hate. <laughs> Both shirts are included. Again, men's large. Let's start the bidding at whoever yells a number I can hear. One dollar. One twenty. Six thousand. Who was that? Sixty. Excellent. We're at six. You say sixty-nine? Because I heard you say sixty-nine. Excellent. We're at nice dollars over here. Who wants to be double nice dollars, which is a hundred and fifty-eight? No. 38, 138? What is it, math? <laughs> yeah, 138. Who wants to do nice times two? Yell the number. 138. Double nice! Ah! We just are $138 that I am calling a meme. 138 and or double nice. Do we go to a triple nice? Because that would be hysterical. What's it going to be? 186? 270? That can't be 9 times 3. It's 69 is 9. I'm sorry, okay, so there's a thing called the internet. It's a series of tubes, and on it, the number 69 is represented by the word nice. 
207? Does anyone want to go to triple nights? 207. I'm sorry, who? So we were at Double Nice up front, which is 130 what? 138, I'm sorry. 138 was 207. Why did I bring this on myself? I, I could just say numbers. I could just be saying numbers instead of adding difficulties. We were at 138 up front. Who wants to make it an even 150? Because that'd be freaking great. 138 going once. 150. That's the same person who has the other bag, so I want to applaud like triple if I for that. Thank you. There's a singular person who's trying to take this charity on the back right now. Anyway, 150 going once. Going twice. Woo! $200 up front. Clap for these people. Absolutely. $200 going once. <laughs> $300. Continue applauding, please. If you're not going to clap, pull out your wallet. $300 going once. Twice? $300 sold to our friend up front. Thank you so much for contributing materially to the feeding of many, many large animals. If you want to stand up and turn around, please do, but if you're uncomfortable, I don't want to put you on the spot. Thank you very much for, for being the charity person of the show. So, who else would we like to bankrupt? <laughs> okay, do I... Do I use the, well, I'm sorry, were you saying you'd like to bid $500 for those shirts? Well, we will be paying $20, I won't. <laughs> I'm in the phone book, it's the one across the hall. If you don't answer, I'll just ring it off the wall. I know he's there, but I just got to call. Don't leave me hanging on the telephone. Don't leave me go to work or just go to the store all those things she said i told you to ignore oh why can't we talk again oh why can't we talk again oh why can't we talk again they may hang on my telephone don't leave me hanging on my telephone it's good to hear your voice you know it's been so long if I don't get your call, then everything goes wrong. I need to tell you something you don't know how long. Don't leave me hanging on the telephone. Don't leave me hanging on the telephone. Your voice across the line gives me a strange sensation I'd like to talk when I can show you my affection Oh, I can't control myself Oh, I can't control myself Oh, I can't control myself Don't leave me hanging on the telephone Don't leave me hanging on the telephone Hang up and run to me insinuate that I don't know that people want to hear the penis song. I have one. 
I have two. We're gonna do one for me and one for you. Does that sound fair? I think you should make call that donation bucket up before you do that last one. Donation bucket before? Well, okay. So remember that the donation bucket, if you don't see one, you're like, what about money? Guitar case. Everything that goes in the guitar case goes immediately to the charity. We can't, look, so we're already like, look, I'm do, I've, I've already kind of given up the goat of, I'm doing it. So, <laughs> but I would like to first do a song, uh, like I said, for me. I wrote a song, after the, the penis song became such a thing on the internet, which I'm absolutely grateful for. I'd rather someone listen to only that than nothing I've ever written. I was like, well, how come I, I need to write a song that's about the thing that I want to sing about? This song is called Step on my face and tell me that you love me. I need to make sure my guitar is in tune for this. I want to disrespect the the the, the literature here, you know what I'm saying? Who has paws in the industry? Anybody? That's right, all of you. All of us, all of God's children. <laughs> That's not completely true. You could be born without feet. I mean, that is a, a real possibility. And I'm sorry to those of you here who are born without feet. But I will be performing if you're born without a horse top. Also, I'm very sorry. Your disappointment will come later. <laughs> Ah, 
under a lock. Oh, don't stop that. His cock. Be ready for all of the DJs. I am so far done. Oh no, we started at 9. It's like 10 02. Holy F. We've like nailed it. Is this a 90 minute set? How long is this schedule for? Do not fucking tell me two hours. If that's real, I'm like, okay, good night. <laughs> is it 90 minutes? Does anyone confirm on the thing? Like, I was gonna say, this is only an hour, right? And the dances start like now? Do I have anything that's like. I didn't die. Battery. I oh, my God. Party ball. Fucking bitch. <laughs> wow, even the mic just had other ideas. <laughs> hey, Pepper. Hey, Pepper. Red rocket. <laughs> I am so mad that I was fully convinced, I'm like, haha, that's a funny bit. And I start talking, I'm like, ah, oh, they'll put it back on, don't worry. And then I'm like, what is happening? <laughs> okay, thank you very much for coming. That was extremely funny. So, well, after I scream, I won't do another song, I promise. Like, I don't, I can't think of a more appropriate way to end the effing thing. Like, I could do one more cover, like, none of it's gonna, like, compare. Well, you know what I actually want to end the set with? This is going to seem like a meme. Uh, thank you all very much for coming. I appreciate you being here so much. I do not come to, this is only the first time I've ever been in an Oklahoma hotel and having any more than zero people blows my mind, let alone like having a, a thank you for coming. I have many, many tears to cry. <laughs> I don't know how to express myself, but thank you for being here. <laughs> okay. So. Oh my god, so now I'm like, what is the song called again? You wouldn't know, because you're not in my head. Should I berate you more? <laughs> just... Oh no, I deleted the thing called cover set. <laughs> I have to like Google the part of the song I know. You ever do that? You're like, I know a couple of phrases in the song. Oh no, I can, I can do this. This is actually exciting. Uh, so I have some advice for your future performers out there. If you're ever doing a set, figure out a way to kill absolutely all momentum in it after doing something like relatively emotional and real. Like be completely prepared to like not know the name of a song. You can't, okay, there it is. I did find it. This is gonna be worth it. And I can't even describe to you how worth it it's gonna be. After this, I'm just gonna walk off. It's gonna be very dramatic. If I told you to wait for me after the show, do it. And if I didn't, well, I never said that, did I? Crawling in my skin, <laughs> these wounds they will not heal. Fear is how I fall, confusing what is real. Something inside me that pulls beneath the surface Consuming, confusing This lack of self-control I fear is never ending Controlling, I can't seem to find myself again My walls are closing in without the sense of confidence I'm convinced that there's just too much pressure to take I felt this way before, so insecure Stand aside my own reflection. It's haunting how I 
can't seem to find myself again. These walls are closing in. I've got a sense of confidence. I notice that there's just too much pressure to take. I felt this way before. So